So after painting the doors in the previous episode, I decided it was time to paint the front half of the car. But while disassembling the front of the car, I realized I'm leaving on a holiday in three weeks with the Samurai. So maybe painting the whole front was a little bit too much. So I decided to only paint the grill and one of the fenders. I have never welded before, but I really wanted to try and fix the holes in the fenders myself. So we are back here at my dad's workshop, um, it's time to get the Samurai ready for our holiday trip. I'm leaving in two weeks, so uh, we still have to work a bit on the mechanics from the car. We've got a gearbox, which I rebuilt a couple of years ago with a friend of mine, so this one should be better than the one that's still in the car. And from the transfer case, we've been struggling a bit with getting a proper transfer case, I decided to sent mine to HM 4x4 in Italy and the guys they in there they rebuild it for me and I got it back in the post this week so I think they did a really nice job on fixing it up or rebuilding it. It is quite expensive, but I'm hoping, because I've been having so many troubles with transfer cases, I'm hoping for now everything is going to be all right, right for a few years. Um, I hope that gearbox is good enough, well, at least not noisy. And I also have over there, I picked up this engine uh, from a second hand engine but it looked really nice with very low uh, kilometers on it so I was planning on putting that in before the holidays but um, I'm already leaving in two weeks so I'm not sure if I'm able to do it this weekend or I'm just gonna keep the old engine and then after the holidays put this one in
I went to Susie's place to gather some parts that I need for the project. The guys over there helped me very well. I uh, got some new shocks, a steering damper and a few other small pieces and a new hood. I started putting down some primer on the panels and this is where some bad luck started to happen. The electrical engine from my compressor decided to die. During the night it got quite windy and it blew over my framework. So uh, I didn't film it correctly so you don't see it on this video but the panel is very bad. So off camera I already bent this panel back quite a bit but um, it went quite easily so I decided to try it just by hand bend it a little bit better. Looking back at it I should have spent a lot more time on getting this panel nice and straight because after painting you can still see a lot of dents from the accident which really is a shame but I was a little bit in a time crunch to get everything ready before the holiday. Because the big compressor died, I put two small compressors together to get enough air pressure for painting. This actually worked really really well. Just as I finished painting, it started raining for a few minutes. This meant all my paintwork got wet, so I had to sand down everything once more and repaint it once more. But I was very pleased with the end result. I've got a feeling I'm starting to really learn how to paint.
So yes, she definitely looks a bit ridiculous being half painted and half not, but hopefully very soon she will be fully painted in the right color. For now, we got everything loaded for the holidays, so join us in the next video where we will be on the road with the Samurai.